Hey everybody, it's been a while since I did one of these, so uh, I thought I would thought I would show you some recent purchases. I, it's the first time I've gone out since the uh, beginning of the year, so um, found some some neat stuff. Again, mostly books, but um, I'll run you through the stuff real quick, and then and then we'll talk about the books. So um, this is the weirdest, I'd say, a librarian action figure. It was two dollars. Um, <clears throat> You know, new in package is a little, little ragged on the bottom, but that's okay. Um, Twenty four dollars on Amazon, so pretty happy with that. All of these um, little Avon Mother's Day plates. These are tiny little ones. Um, those are fifty cents a piece. Got them at Habitat uh, for Humanity, and um, they'll sell eight ninety five. You probably clear. Uh, about four bucks a piece. So I'm going to try to see if I can't find a place locally that I can uh, that I can sell them for a little bit more than that. So um, three dollars for brand new lists on Amazon for five eighty one. Um, probably try to sell it locally because the fees will just eat you up on that fees and shipping. These I don't know if they have any value, but um, these are. 1975, if you can see. Oh, apparently, it's not going to focus. But um, 1975, you know, Little Lamb, Bambi. The one that I thought was the most amusing is the Mickey Mouse Club. Um, again, don't know if they have any real value, but in any case, they can be a neat little gift. Um, stuff I had when I was a kid. So, um, hats, you know, these were a dollar a piece. This one is is nicer, but I think it's a little a um, little bit more ragged. And this is you know okay. It's a little bit of damage on the back, but um, for a dollar you can sell them for ten, and uh, <clears throat> you know make a bit of money. So now we'll talk about books. Let me set this down for a second. Oh, drop the phone. Oh well. And, um, <clears throat> you know, again, I changed my rules, and anything anything you see here is uh, $10 or more. So, um, and I'll point out some, some ones that, that are the most, uh, kind of, a little bit more expensive. This one was just 10 bucks, but it was $0.50 cents to purchase. They stuck a label on the front, which did some damage coming off, which is a shame. Um, it was in perfect shape and, and, you know, kind of old pulps like that, not, these are, you know, 1950s, 1960s prints of, um, you know, popular fiction. Let's see if this is in here. It doesn't have the date, but, you know, anyway, not a, um, probably anything that's going to make you huge money, but. You can put a lot together, or you know, this was that was ten dollars on Amazon. So, um, I don't remember if any of these. I think these were all, you know, around ten to fifteen dollars. Um, I think this was a little bit more than that. Um, this was forty-five, I think. Um, <clears throat> you know, a, a nursing textbook apparently is is some some money. Um, I didn't find these are all these are all ten ten dollars. This is in kind of ragged shape, but it was fifteen or twenty something like that. This is a woman that is has no arms, I think, and does everything with her feet. So that's it. I mean, that's worth the dollar or seventy five cents for a uh, um, for a paperback book. Just that glamour shot with her foot <laughs> is worth it. So, um, and then the, I think this was 15, um, the big ones were that one nursing book and then these two, this, uh, 45 and this was 38. So, um, railway people are generally pretty nutty. <laughs> um, they will pay, they will pay a lot of money for their stuff and, um, you know, it's got this weird, like, lamination on it, but I think it'll come off with, um, 
you know, with an X-Acto blade, just, I don't think it's actually stuck. It's just tight. So, um, sometimes you can find stuff like this that is, you know, very, very niche and, um, and pretty valuable. And then this other one is a book of German photography. So, um, <clears throat> you know, and it's German photography in German, printed in Germany, and imported, and it's probably, um, I forget, 38 something. So, um, so that's it. All of this stuff is going to be on Amazon probably before this video even gets uploaded. Uh, but uh, check out my stores, my Amazon and eBay stores, and uh, uh, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks a lot.